Okay, greetings, fellow game changers. This is Rich coming at you again. Boy, K, the game changer. Apparently, the trendy thing to do is speak about the Nintendo Switch, so I figure I might as well share a few thoughts with me here. Uh, we're running a presentation and doing it kind of chopped off here. Um, yeah, it doesn't matter. I, I like this because it's delayed, because this way it's distorting it enough that Nintendo isn't going to block this video. I want to talk about it so anyhow you'll see what it was is it's pausing and delaying whatever else so yeah well i guess that's a good sign so anyhow this is the presentation that went on last night i wasn't going to do a video but i figured i saw a few things that might pop up that struck me as of interest to it and i'll share my thoughts for it i am i'm kind of concerned what's happening here it doesn't fit with the channel but we'll see there are some things i did it's not necessarily in the presentation but elsewhere i looked at something else i i thought i saw and you can confirm that for me here so anyhow what i saw regarding the switch and everything else is i i swore i saw in one of the videos there that you can use uh four of the joy cons together so you can have four players on a single switch that's what i saw they showed a picture of it and they showed a second one here so you can hook it up that way so with the if that's true you have eight systems linked together you could have a game with 32 players which would be really cool they also have these slide-on adapters on top of it to make it more playable, so they act like a six-button classic controller. Uh, those fit in, so they do it. So uh, for me, the controller part is uh, cool, and I think it's useful. You have here with Nintendo and everything else, I think it would be useful what they have here. Boy, this thing's not moving, is it? <laughs> yeah, I'm running the video, and apparently it's decided to pause out on me, so anyhow. Uh, but anyhow, this is for the presentation. Uh, I'm sorry about it. Let me just talk over the things we had here. Uh, let me see if I can do something else, though. I just want to be able to get some video here. So let's pause it. There we go. So anyhow, let's do what we can here. I will go on behind it. And uh, let's go ahead and hit the play button and see if this actually does something here. So yeah, speaking of the Joy-Cons, you have them there, which I think was cool here. I know one of the things you had here with like the motion control and everything else, there have been complaints about the motion control. I'm going to speak a little bit about that later, about my concern about the future. Honestly, though, the motion control wouldn't be a problem with it here. I think it's good they're trying to do it. So I like the idea that they're trying to innovate with the controllers and do things here. I mean, one of the things of classic arcade games and something else is they introduce an experience that's more natural. You have a novelty effect and everything else that would be useful. So that's not a problem with it here. Uh, there are a few other things I see happening here, and this has to do with the sales or anything else here. We'll get to that in a minute. I just want to pop in something else I saw here. I was looking amongst the list of it, and I don't know if the Xbox One will have it, but the PS4 has it. It's the arcade archive, so you get the classic arcade games, which I'd be happy to see here. So anyhow, that's one thing I'd be fortunate about. So that's one thing I kind of would like to see have happening here. So, I mean, that, to have the arcade games that way there. Uh, one of the things I'm concerned about is Nintendo shorted the specs on the RAM. You could do the SD cards and put extra memory on them, the, the cards that they're doing for the storage, so you don't need it, so they do things here. But it, it was like a little bit of smokes and mirrors. They're, they're showing Skyrim and some other ones, but like where EA's only doing FIFA. Were the other things? Did they mention Mass Effect Andromeda, for example, coming up? A lack of AAA here. When your system doesn't get the AAA major titles with it, you end up being a console that's different regarding everything. So the end result of that there, when you have this, when you have that happen, when you have this happen here, the problem that you have is that you have to hit it out of the park with like the Wii by hitting different controller. That is one of the things that you need to happen. If it doesn't happen there, yes, I just skipped ahead for the video just to see what's going to happen here. So apparently it's skipping too much, but anyhow. All right, it's behind. We'll see what's going to happen. It doesn't matter. I'm just using it for noise to show video. You have to hit it out with the park with what is different. And if you don't hit it out of the park with what's different, you end up doing it. And the end result was is you, you end up missing the mark and you have what Nintendo happened. Nobody buys it. The developers don't come across. And your your second console with Wii, it worked. But with the Switch, I really have to wonder it. I mean, with the Switch, what really mattered for the Switch, and this is the selling point because it's excited, is they could play all the modern AAA games on the go and you have it. 
by getting that there, you get enough sales to justify it. If you don't do that and you're trying to go with the different controllers because you want to short on the specs, what's the Nintendo is. The end result is that you end up not getting the titles and you have what happened with like the Wii U, for example. It's a problem. That is a problem that you have happening here that Nintendo is going to run into. You get the system, you get the content, everything else, then you can experiment and have the titles that way. So I got to really short it. I think the weak point like the Wii, the Wii U had was it had no storage for on the internal drive. I mean, the thing is it had nothing else there and there was no other way to do it. So there was no place to sell the DLC. Now I think they're shorting on the RAM. You could say, oh, it doesn't matter everything else. Yes, it does. I also have to wonder if Skyrim's going to be able to support the user, uh, the user generated content. No indication it's going to. So honestly, I am, this is the part I'd be concerned about. And this is a sales perspective for me. Having it that way is fine. But beyond that though, I would have to be a bit concerned about everything and what the future holds with the system, if they're going to have it that way. So that's my thought here. Am I going to get one? I have other priorities to do. Uh, I have other things I am not playing now. So that's what I'm looking at here. So anyhow, uh, so this is a concern I have about it. Uh, Nintendo, look at the titles that they're coming out with. You're, they're not having the... They are not having... It doesn't look like a lot of AAA stuff here. They have to get the ports, and it has to be the recent stuff coming out here. And it can't just be a sports title. It has to be more than Skyrim. Otherwise, Nintendo's going to go down the path like everybody said they do it. They short the corner somewhere trying to do it. But if the developers aren't going to be able to squeeze the games they want into the system, and I'm more worried about the lack of RAM than pretty much everything else, secondary storage is a second issue, but you can always store the content on it. If they don't manage to get this right, you're looking at troubles here. So anyhow, I understand what Nintendo wants to push. They're trying to push the differentiating, the blue ocean with the different controllers and all that, which is kind of cool and everything else. But once the content follows, they're in the same boat again. And it's going to be a second console for people here. So that's what's looking at here. I mean, is there any Call of Duty coming to the system? Uh, Activision certainly get used to do it. How about... How about like Overwatch, for example? Is that going to come here? I'm not seeing a lot of stuff that way, and that, that's that's a troubling sign for it, for the sales. So anyhow. Okay, that's it. I'm hoping this goes okay. I think my video's gone to blast it. So anyhow, I'm going to sign out here. I hope this went okay. So now that's it. So I do want to thank you for watching. May your die. Always roll five. Remember, don't hate the player. Change the game. And I'm hoping this video works. So okay, take care. Bye.